My God, my allergies are killing me. I'm sneezing up a storm. My eyes are getting watery and itchy, but I'ma still film this video, y'all. Welcome, you guys. Y'all know I've been following Easy and Natalie, and they uploaded a video. Don't know if this is clickbait. I'm not quite sure. But Easy and Natalie uploaded a video called Why We Aren't Together Anymore. The truth. What the hell is going on? Because y'all better not be dis- <laughs> Listen, it's not about us. It's not about disappointing us. It's about why put it all out there if y'all didn't even know what you wanted. You know what I mean? So if that's a factual title, y'all fucked yourselves over. That shit was messy. But if it's clickbait, what does that mean? Like it's over, like what's over? Like what is this about? I don't know, but I'm gonna jump right to it because I need to know what's going on. Are y'all ready? Let's go. Why did you guys unfollow each other? Why haven't you guys been hanging around each other? Not too long ago, I was going through a lot of things with her family and I had made some tweets. I don't know what you want me to say to you right now. Okay, that looked like it was acting, but you know how it's I feel. Sensation. Y'all know, y'all know. Like I'm in and out of what's real and what's not. I don't know at this time. Gay, 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 gay. I just want to say first and foremost, Black Lives Matter, and everything that's been going on, I am hurt. If you haven't been living under a rock and not knowing what's going on with this George Floyd shoot, everything we've been dealing with for years, comment hashtag Black Lives Matter, and I just want to say. You know, we had to take a break from social media because it was just a lot. Let me say something. Yes, everyone who hashtags all lives matter. Yes, of course all lives matter. But for some reason, we are mistreating certain races, especially the black community. When you hear the words black lives matter, I don't think y'all understand that black lives also matter. That's the problem. And when it comes to blue lives matter, y'all, I hate when people say that shit because listen, being a police officer is not a life. It's a job, it's an occupation. We're talking about lives, lives. We're not talking about jobs. Let me get back to this video. On our personal lives, but it's just like, as far as posting, we can't fake content and act like we're super happy and act like, oh, let's do like some challenges and stuff like that when all these real issues are going on in the fucking world, y'all. Okay, so I want to start off by saying that. And with that being said, if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. I just feel like ever since we kind of came out, like me and Natalie, our story, there's been a lot of drama going on behind the scenes, and it's it, it's really emotional for me to make this video with the protests and the stuff going on. Um, along with that. It's just like so many things have you know transpired with me and Natalie and it's kind of just new for us and there's a lot of things that we aren't showing you guys because we can't pick up a camera 24 7 you know but it's like I want to be truthful I want to be honest with you guys so you guys okay. know what's going on you guys have been having questions about yo why did you guys unfollow each other why haven't you guys been hanging around each other you know what I'm saying if you guys notice in some of the videos like a few of them were pre-recorded before all of this stuff was going on mm, and stuff like that gotcha. and it's just like you guys can tell that there has been something going on and today I'm here to address it I'm going to um, talk to Natalie for the first time and kind of nervous um, you know and see that's annoying that is annoying. Now y'all know I support their relationship or whatever they got going on. But if there's issues behind the camera, and this is gonna be your first time seeing her and talking to her, why are you bringing the camera? What is more important to you guys? Is it social media or is it your lives? There's just some things that we don't need to see, you know what I mean? It's gonna affect you guys and it's not gonna work. And she has some news that she wants to tell you guys I already oh, know. There we go. And it is very heartbreaking, but you know, dealing with our friendship for over three years, it's something that I can't handle. Okay. Um, but I just want to, you know, we want to keep you guys updated on what's going on and what's going to happen between me and Natalie. Oh my God. Before I actually, um, you know, head to Natalie's house, I kind of want to sit here and talk about like, you know, what's been going on with me and then she could discuss like what she's been kind of going through. I guess we could talk about it together. But pretty much if you guys haven't seen or don't know what's going on between me and her, not too long ago, I, you know, I was going through a lot of things and behind the scenes with, you know, her family. And I 
I had made some tweets. You know, I made some tweets and it was pure selfishness, pure emotions what? that came up that I was triggered by from the past, you know? And I didn't know how to express that. And I decided to take what? it to social media. Because I'm so used to this social media life and being real and stuff like that. It's just some things you shouldn't do because it will ruin a relationship. You know what I'm saying? And I So you know this, but you're still continuing this. I don't get it feel like me doing that was childish. Me doing that was not being in control of my emotions. And I've been doing so much work on myself and I've been growing and learning how to deal with my emotions. And the fact that I have been preaching about spirituality and preaching about growth, I took a huge step back. And I just want to say I apologize. My actions did cause a reaction and what happened does anyone know please comment below because i don't know what the hell she's talking about i don't follow them on instagram or twitter apparently she talked some shit uh, uh, about her family or something and comment below please how natalie is feeling about certain things okay. i completely understand and i have to respect so i i you know i'm only human and I'm not going to sit here and justify my actions. I'm not going to sit here and say like, oh, because I'm human, I get to do this. Oh, what? I can't feel certain emotions. And it's just like, no, you do something and it's a reaction to it. And depending on how the person can handle what you do is it's going to determine, you know, the, your future together or anybody's, you know, whether it's friends, family, anything. But so I'm going over to talk to her about it right now. And um, like I said, there's something that she really needs to tell everybody. Oh, boy. You know, <coughs> uh, it's, it's something that, I, you know, if I wasn't working on myself, I feel like I wouldn't be able to handle. But I understand what she has to say and, you know, things that she needs to do. You know, I'm going to head over there right now and take you guys with me. And Oh, my God. Um, what is it? <sighs> It's been one hell of a roller coaster of emotions, y'all. Especially like not coming out too long ago how I'm in love with this woman. All right, well, I'm just, I'm just gonna go over there and we we'll talk about it there. And it's only been like a month, right? Am I wrong? Am I tripping? I wanna get there. <sighs> so, my Natalie's crib right now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling so many emotions right now. It's like. There's so many emotions that I feel and certain things because I can't change them. It's just like hard, but it's how you deal with certain things. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to right now. With the suicide doors, okay. Hey, how's it going? What is that? Why do you have a suitcase on a wagon in the corner of the street? What what's going on? How you doing? Cool. Can I get a hug? Okay, so I know they're not following each other on Instagram. That's been known. Their supporters are on top of it. They've been commenting about it. And they haven't been filming together. And I noticed that when Easy was at that protest, Natalie wasn't with her. And usually they would do things like that together. So something's going on. This girl's over here saying she misses her and shit. What is um, going on? You have my weights. Huh? You have my weights? Yeah, I brought them in the car. I see you brought your suitcase and stuff down. Okay. What is Probably going on? I'm gonna get your weights, hold on. Yeah, put it in there. Help yeah. you. Well, alright. Um, that's all your weights and stuff. Um, do you want to, you know, before everything happens, like, kind of like talk and just make sure we're both on the same page, especially as far as communication and where my head's at and where your head's at? Um, I actually, you know, I'm, I need to get on the road because it's a long drive, so I wasn't really like, planning to talk. I was just kind of leave this up. I mean, I just feel like, like, can I please just get a conversation? You know, I just need a little bit more clarity and, you know, just making sure that I'm not, you know, thinking any other way except for exactly what you tell me. Please. Just a conversation. All right. Huh? All right. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I hope you take your stuff upstairs and then we can talk upstairs. No, we can just talk right here because I don't have much time anyway, so. 
Damn, she's pissed, yo. Natalie is going through something. Sh what Easy tweeted must have been really bad because Natalie ain't having it. Right now, the ball is in her court. It's on her terms. So it's up to her if a conversation even happens. So, so ooh, something happened. Let me slip on my coke real quick. Can I still record? Yeah. Sure, sure we don't have to. It's alright, you know, like I just feel like. Oh. <laughs> it's an easy game, so I guess it's fine. Okay. And a trash can, huh? <laughs> so, um, I kind of told them, and you know, you already know, like, kind of how I feel, but, you know, you can kind of reiterate it and, you know, kind of tell me so I don't have any, you know, misunderstandings or I don't think that there's hope and then there's not or no hope and there is, like, you know, kind of just break down what you're feeling. Um, What's going on, Nat Nat? You know, first of all, I just want to say that thank you guys for being supportive forgiving um you know us some space like through this time i know a lot of you guys noticed um certain things that were alarming like us not following each other and you know you guys are kind of putting two and two together because um some of you also noticed the tweet that she made what tweet you know, i just want to say thank you for not being too intrusive and being patient with kind of what's going on between us um does this have to do with your brother? Because he's the only one that I felt that was on her side of the family that is not on the same boat with this whole situation. Was it a tweet towards him? Really hard guys, like when you live a public life and you're also really going through stuff to know how to deal with it, you know? Because sometimes having too many opinions doesn't help. Um, but then also I know that we're trying to have a more open line and stream of communication with you guys so that you really, you know, understand us and feel like a part of us, our friends and family. I don't really know what you want me to say. You know, I know that you came for some type of clarity, some type of maybe confidence or me to say something that was going to make you feel better or soothe. Well, what I notice right now is that they're still wearing their rings, so the friendship's gonna stand, but their whole romantic situation, it might not happen, man. That you have, but I don't, I don't know what you want me to say to you right now. I mean, I, I just, I know you wanted to bring my weights in, in hopes that you'd be able to get a little conversation in, but... Ain't gonna happen. There's nothing that I can say. There's nothing that I want to tell you right now, you know? Damn. Like, I'm sorry, like the only thing that I can tell you right now. Wait, but I'm I'm sorry. I just I just need you to hear me out of like, you don't have to be sorry about anything. I'm the one that So okay, Natalie. Whatever she tweeted couldn't be this bad to the point where you don't know how you feel about easy and there's no way that it came to the point to where it's like you don't want this anymore. Off of one tweet. One tweet. Do y'all know what a relationship is? Y'all gonna go up and down. It's, a, it's gonna be a roller coaster ride. Life ain't perfect. Romantic relationships ain't perfect. So if one tweet, girl, and it just started, y'all been like talking to each other for like literally like a month or so? Come on now. Let's grow up a little bit, please. I have to go. What do you Come here. Come here. I hate this shit. I swear to God, with a part one. I hate this. Listen, I'm gonna tell y'all something. I don't like this little to be continued thing, this part one, this part two, this part three. This is why it doesn't seem real. You know what I'm saying? And think about their book. Their book is How to Master the Art of Social Media. This video right here talked about unfollowing each other on Instagram, which is one platform, a tweet on Twitter, that's another platform, and then making videos on YouTube which is another platform. Mastering the art of social media. I feel like they know exactly what they're doing. They might possibly be teaching us how to get engagement from their audience and how to gain supporters and followers in such a short period of time. Because lately it's been working. And it's a great way to promote your book. It's you proving to us that y'all know exactly what it takes 
to master the arts of social media. Listen, I really hope they're not bullshitting with us because it's starting to piss me off, okay? Am I, am I the only one that feels this way? Comment below, please. Please don't let me feel like I'm alone on this. But I guess we'll wait for part two. Y'all know I'm gonna react because it's working. The social media thing, it's working. <laughs> All right, you guys, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.